Right there, Motorola Spotlight Player, that's bloatware. NFL Mobile, that's bloatware. So this HP Print Services, that would be bloatware. I don't need that, never installed it. Welcome to Gage and Gadgets. In this tutorial, we'll be looking at how to remove bloatware from your Android phone. This is part of a series of Android tips and tutorials that I'll be doing, so go ahead and hit the subscribe button below so that you can make sure you stay up to date and get all of those videos. So let's start with what bloatware is. So bloatware is going to be any application such as these VZ navigators that were installed by Verizon Wireless or this Spotlight Stories which was installed by Motorola, the manufacturer of my phone. So I don't really want these on my phone because first they take up storage. They could also run in the background, be collecting data or just using up the RAM on my phone. Okay, so when looking for bloatware you need to go to your settings and then go to apps. And right now you're in your downloaded section right here. So you just want to swipe right until you go to all. And now we'll be able to see all the bloatware that's installed. This is every single item that has been installed on this device. Be it from the factory or something I installed. So now that we've found some items that we know are bloatware, like this Motorola Spotlight Player, the way to disable it is to go in, select it, and then you just go in to disable. So I can force it to stop, but see how there's no option to uninstall it? Just go hit disable, or I can go back, let's see something that I did install, or like finance. I have the option to uninstall it. But if I go into this bloatware Motorola Spotlight Player, I am unable to uninstall it. The best I can do is just disable it, which just kind of freezes it. It can't update, it can't be ran, nothing, it can't be running in the background. So really it's just going to take up 3.4 megabytes of my storage, but it won't be running in the background, taking up any memory, or recording any of my data. So that's how you remove bloatware from your Android device. If you have any questions or you have any problems while you're doing this, go ahead below in the comments section and leave your question there. I'll get back to you as soon as I can, which is much, with as much detail as I can. Don't forget to subscribe and rate this video if it really helped you. I'll be posting more videos related to Android and also just tech tutorials and do-it-yourself things that are really cool. So stick around and check out those in my channel, Gaging Gadgets, and go to gagingadgets.com for a write-up that's something you can share about this tutorial. Thank you for watching.